Oh, what an opportunity. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Lionel Messi! Oh, it's in! They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It is Liverpool against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. This is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Jordan Henderson starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. And he got to it fairly easily. Neymar. We wonder who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. Well, what can we say? All's well that ends well. Well, he's just about recovered the situation. That could have been very embarrassing. Darwin Nunez. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with... Could be! And it's in! Liverpool up on the scoring in the Champions League final. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Verratti. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And space to attack. Luis Diaz. Oh, he's through here. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Short corner it is. Was a risky challenge, but brilliantly executed. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. And options in the centre. Neymar. Danilo Pereira. Hakimi. throws himself up the ball <laughs> playing it short an attack full of promise determined defending Hakimi Able to close down the shots. The PSG trailing and in need of inspiration from the corner. 
Well, it has come to nothing. Getting the better of his opponent. Teammate in support. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So back underway. They've leveled it at 1-1 here. Difficult to stop him. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Salah. Darwin Nunez. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. It might be the moment to get them ahead. He's trying to create something. Well read to win possession back. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. Messi. There will be one minute added on at the end. Mbappe. And threaded through by Mbappe. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Hakimi. It's with Danilo Pereira. Oh, what an opportunity. Couldn't quite hang on. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Lionel Messi! Oh, it's in! They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. Well, as Liverpool get the ball moving again, how will they react? Verratti. Now with Akimi. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and throw out the opposition. Messi, Messi, well the keeper does his job. Well nice idea, but he didn't quite get enough on it, did he? And a throw in it's going to be. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Can he play it in? Oh, managing to beat him. High echelon goalkeeping there. Playing it in. On a time for composure on the ball. Lovely work to get past his man. It might appeal to Wijnaldum. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, they profit from this situation. This could level it. Oh, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Henderson. Alexander Arnold. 
Henderson. And the textbook interception. And threading it forward. And Neymar is in here. Surely. Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, they can keep possession now. Thiago. Darwin Nunez. Fabinho. Here's Salah. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh, a goal for Liverpool, who are now on level terms. Well, let's take another look. It's a really well-timed pass to break the offside line, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. has been quite the roller coaster ride. Idrissa Gay. Progressive football from Paris Saint Germain. They know a goal of it. What an important save given the scoreline. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Derek. That's a big save. So late in the game, he's just saved his team there. Paris Saint-Germain with the ball again. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? Well, an easy one to cut out, really. Neymar. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Now the perfect position to read it. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Well, back underway here, and it's quite simple. Both teams must steal themselves for 30 extra minutes. Verratti. It's Kimpembe now. Mbappe. Neymar crisp tackling and he couldn't quite get himself back on side Stuart well as a player you need to be able to change your mind but he wasn't able to and that's a poor pass well the pass by Mbappe he'll be disappointed Mbappe Gay on to Di Maria and the keeper taking care of the situation Doesn't want to lose his call here. Fabinho. Fabinho. A real opening now. Well, from that position, he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper. The danger is averted. There will be one minute added on at the end. And the first period of extra time comes to an end. Still level here.
And so the drama continues here. We're into the second period of extra time. Mbappe. Di Maria likes to get on the ball. And he has teammates to pass it to. And up for grabs off the keeper. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Breaking at pace. And a strong tackle. Five minutes left in the second period of extra time. If nothing changes, it will be decided by means of a penalty shootout. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And he might be in here. And a goal for Liverpool with time running out in this UEFA Champions League final. Well, here it is again. The ball over the top is an absolute beauty, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. How about this? England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.